Smart Culture, Science. We are going to observe a chemical reaction between zinc powder and dilute hydrochloric acid, and we'll test the gas that forms during the reaction. Let's find out what happens when these two substances react. So the first step is to carefully pour some dilute hydrochloric acid into the flask. Make sure that you are wearing safety goggles and gloves and that you are working in a well-ventilated area. Next, you add a small amount of zinc powder to an Erlenmeyer flask. Remember, zinc is a metal and in powdered form, it reacts faster because it has a large surface area. That means we'll see results quickly. Now, as soon as the acid touches the zinc, you'll see bubbles forming. That's a chemical reaction taking place. The bubbling you see is the production of a gas. That gas is hydrogen. The zinc reacts with hydrochloric acid to form zinc chloride, which stays dissolved in the solution, and hydrogen gas, which escapes as bubbles. So here's the word equation. Zinc plus hydrochloric acid gives us zinc chloride plus hydrogen gas. Now let's test whether the gas being produced is hydrogen. While the reaction is still bubbling, bring a burning match carefully to the mouth of the flask. Don't insert it into the flask. That popping sound confirms that the gas is hydrogen. This is called the hydrogen pop test. So what did we learn? When zinc powder reacts with dilute hydrochloric acid, it produces hydrogen gas. And we can confirm this using a simple flame test. This experiment is a great way to observe a single displacement reaction, test for hydrogen gas and practice safe chemical handling. And that's a wrap on today's fascinating journey through the world of knowledge. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and join our ever-growing community of curious minds. We can't wait to embark on new educational adventures together.